next to Mark, so um, it's pretty clear to me what Mark does all day. Um, talks on the phone, because he's kind of got this low, murmuring voice that I hear droning on throughout the course of any given day. Um, he listens to classical music, and kind of cranks it out pretty loud in there at times. Um, and I think he just writes books and does smart guy stuff. Well, I think he's uh, probably doing some uh, television interviews on the phone or radio interviews, maybe, writing a couple of books, um, that type of thing. Mark probably combs over the Bible all day. It's his favorite thing to do. He does nothing but read. I predict when the end of the world might be. Um, you know, he kind of looks at all his charts and graphs and prophecy stuff. And I think he's got it narrowed down to some point in between August of 2007 uh, to February of 2012. Somewhere in there, uh, he'll be able to kind of pinpoint the exact day that the, the church will be raptured. So that's exciting. Um, and obviously, that takes up a lot of a lot of time. Um, that's pretty much what I. Um, he prays and reads, studying the Bible, writing, and uh, meeting with people. That's what I do. Scott is the manager. He runs the place. He's always running around. We're always looking for him. It's hard to say. I, I don't think Scott does anything. Uh, Scott uh, writes bills, uh, talks to people on the telephone, uh, lets uh, people in to the building and out, studies for lessons he's going to give. Uh, I don't know. He does all kinds of stuff. Uh, Scott Oakley, uh, he does PowerPoints. Yes, very important stuff. Inside church stuff. Yeah. It's not for public uh, consumption. Bob um, makes noise. Uh, you can hear him in there. He plays his piano. He plays the guitar. Uh, sings. Um, decides what we're going to do on Sundays for the services. Um, he does all kinds of things related uh, to music for our church. He's hilarious. He's always saying funny things. Mr. Todd is usually playing music most of the day <laughs> to my entertainment. Uh, what does Todd and Lance do all day? Man, that's a great question. Uh, I do know one thing. We don't have to have like a sound system in the office that plays music or, you know, kind of music or instrumental pleasant, nice office type music um, here at the church because for a good portion of the day all I can hear is his piano and him singing back there. So I guess that's what he does all day. He sings. Um, he's had whole worship services back there in his office just by himself. So um, that's, I guess that's what he does. Sings. Sings. All day. Just sings. Uh, oh man. Um, I'm not sure. I rock. Terry, uh, words like linchpin, glue, super glue. Um, I mean, she is the adhesive, outside of the Holy Spirit, of course, that holds our office squad together. Terry, uh, just the finest secretary uh, you could ever find um, anywhere. So, yeah, Terry's. Terry's top notch. Very good. Uh, and basically uh, does everything. Hmm. I think they're trying to keep me in line at the moment. Talks to his wife on the phone about his twins, uh, what they're doing all day. Um, talks to students. Uh, helps Emily out to make videos like this. <laughs> gives her uh, assignments. Uh, goes to schools and visits kids. All kinds of very important things. Jay is the quiet man. He goes in his room and shuts the door. And you buzz him a call, and he goes, hey! Okay. Um, airing up volleyballs, 
Um, trying to, you know, those ping pong balls get crinkled, you know. That's, uh, he has to kind of massage those out. Well, Jay probably um, surfs the internet all day and just looks at, you know, MySpace accounts and uh, <laughs> all kinds of student accounts to, you know, see basically what you guys are up to. What do I do all day? Um, I read pretty much all day and I pray. Um, if you ask me what I pray for, I pray for the students here at Faith Bible Church um, and I pray for them because they're sinners. And if they stop sinning, then I might actually get some work done. 